The pearl-bordered fritillary, a rare nationally declining butterfly, has rather peculiar habits, making it a challenge to conserve. This magnificent little orange jewel was once common and widespread, taking advantage of our woodland management practices. But as these practices have died out, so has the butterfly. It is now one of the UK's most threatened species, occurring in just 5% of its former haunts. In Wales, the pearl-bordered fritillary, or PBF for short, remains on a handful of south-facing freeth sites, mosaics of grass, bracken and scrub. The latter creates a warm microclimate, a necessary adaptation to our increasingly variable weather. This is a delicate balance, easily upset. Overgrazing destroys the mosaic, but without management, bracken and scrub becomes too dense, excluding the violets, the caterpillar's food plant, as well as other spring flowering plants which are vital nectar for the adult. To arrest the vegetation growth at just the right stage requires regular intervention. For years now, uh, Montgomery Wildlife Trust has been working with local landowners to try and get the right grazing animals for each site. Um, unfortunately, that's been only partially successful. If we take this site as an example, it's grazed by sheep, which is better than no grazing at all, but the sheep tend to favour the grassy areas, um, avoiding dense areas of scrub and bracken. And that gives the latter sort of free reign and um, becomes very dominant and then excludes other plants from the area. So we end up having to bring in uh, mechanical control and we've got a great local contractor who's become quite expert at cutting strips and patches in the bracken. In order to understand how the pearl bordered fritillary is doing and monitor the effects of habitat management, surveys are carried out annually. In April we come out and we look at the habitat and we're looking at how many flowers there are for the butterflies to take nectar from. And we're also looking at bramble um, as an indicator of how much scrub there is. And then once the butterflies are flying, we come out again and we do surveys regularly um, to count the butterflies themselves to see how they're doing. Another site for the pearl bordered fritillary is Llanamanech Rocks Nature Reserve. Here, Wildlife Trust volunteers undertake the mechanical habitat management by hand every winter to benefit the butterflies as well as the special limestone grassland. Despite all this work, pearl-bordered fritillary butterflies remain on a knife edge in Wales. Without our help, they could easily be lost. Thankfully, we understand what makes a difference for this rare enigmatic butterfly. So long as we can continue to get the management right, the pearl-bordered fritillary will remain for future generations to enjoy. <laughs>